you know, I see what it is that I am good at and I, I own that and I step mm -hmm. into that space fully, but I also understand where, you know, support might be needed. Um, so yeah. for example, the retreat that we went on this last year, last year I did it for the first time by myself and this year I was like, I need a team. So, you know, part of that vision for myself was kind of stepping out of my ego um, and knowing when it was time to bring in support um, mm -hmm. and bring in people who had other gifts to bring to the table. Mm -hmm. um, and that's kind of that's what sustained me and in, in, in our company so far. I have a, a great team around me um, and I just want to continue to build that for other women, you know, and create the space for other women that want to kind of experiment or try out this new new phase of their life as well. Yeah. yeah. You brought up something that's really, uh, I think, feel like honest and transparent. Like there's no shame in asking for help. <laughs> right? There, so, ain't, there ain't no shame. <laughs> right, like, let's just put it out there to all the amazing, powerful, get it done kind of women, the mamas, the, the everybody. Right, like sometimes you get to be your best self when you can only focus on the thing that you do the best and let other people do the rest of the stuff. And right, and like that's okay. So one of the ways that I think is really a really transformational in your organization, right, is when you're able to find people who align with the vision and you trust enough to hand over and delegate things that you know are outside of your zone of genius. 